Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm CryptoNobs. In today's video, we have some very, very big news to do with Cardano. Possibly the biggest news of the year, in my opinion, to do with Cardano. So make sure you stick around till the end of the video. If you like anything I bring to you, a like, a subscribe or sharing the video does really help my channel out and don't forget to turn the notification bell on if you do enjoy any of my content with that let's jump straight into the video so we'll start off quickly by taking a look at the current price of cardano if we take a look at its position in the chart it's moved up a whole two spaces and it has not been there in quite a long time i'm pretty sure which is again very very big news it just shows the growth that it is making considering as well majority of the market is going sideways or down Cardano is up a nice percentage, uh, just shy of 10 cents, uh, which is big, big news in my opinion because the hype is seeming to be real. And why has it got a lot of hype around it at the minute? Well, I'm going to explain to you in this video. We're going to start off with the biggest news, I think, in my opinion, and it is going to be Cardano's ADA may be listed on Coinbase before the end of 2020. Now, this is huge. This is huge. In my opinion because coinbase is one of the biggest exchanges out there yes they have had a lot of bad light around them recently but again it just makes the availability to the people that only use coinbase etc etc to be able to buy it which is again big news in my opinion cardano's native cryptocurrency ada may be listed on coinbase by the end of 2020 this news comes following an announcement that ada holders will soon be able to stake their assets in coinbase custody uh, the spokesman from IOHK, Cardano's development company, releases the following statement and it says, With the release of added Dressier, uh, our new suite of libraries and APIs allowing for a seamless modular process of integrating Cardano with exchanges, we've been working closely with a number of exchanges and the community can expect more announcements before the end of 2020. So this is just the start of it, which is just ridiculous in my opinion. If this is the start and there's a lot more announcements to come, I think it's going to be a very exciting year for Cardano. Now again, as I always say, patience is what will make us winners in this space, ladies and gentlemen. I believe in quite a lot of cryptocurrencies and I believe in the technology in quite a lot of the cryptocurrencies. And it's a case of staying patient is what will make us winners in this space. Now, the next big, big news to why now first of all this is probably why the start of its price is going up as well as this next reason um, if you have a look here majority of the market it is showing sign, nice signs of recovery but a lot of it isn't going down or going up too high it's just going more or less sideways action at the minute which is a good sign because it just shows stability even more the next big news about Cardano ladies and gentlemen a lot of you may have heard this but a lot of you may not have also. Now, Cardano Shelly mainnet launch to launch soon. We've been successfully running Node V 1.14.2 on the Shelly public testnet for over a week now, and we can confirm that we will deploy the new node to the Cardano mainnet today, 30th of June, as per the first date uh, uh, in the rollout plan. Shelly offers greater decentralization and lays the groundwork for Guggen, uh, which will introduce smart contracts. The Shelly version of Dialus, sorry, that's poor, um, wallet has been released as well. Now, this is huge in my opinion because this the step that they were saying about last month. This is why Cardano was getting a lot of hype around it last month. Um, and now, as you can see here, they've managed to successfully stick to what they said they were going to do and this is the next big phase for cardano so that's another reason why it might be fueling price and it's not um it's not going sideways it is a lot of it has got a lot of hype around it but it is for good reasons because the coinbase is absolutely massive news in my opinion if that turns out to be true and it does look like it could be by the end of the year as well as cardano shelly mainnet is launched as well which is again big big news it's just incredible to see how far cryptocurrency has come over the past three four years since i've been in it um and i personally have never been more confident in something in my life actually happening where i as said multiple multiple times i don't think it's going to be one cryptocurrency that comes out and that's it that's the winner i think there is the technology behind a lot of these cryptocurrencies are going to be used in a lot of businesses and a lot of countries and a lot of this that and that i don't think one 
will be the the winner for example and that's it i generally think that there are going to be multiple multiple cryptocurrencies that are obviously legitimate and showing how good they can be they will be uh, the technology that thrives and thrives the future um in my opinion it's again it's just big big news um the last n bit of news ladies and gentlemen now this is again this is a big company uh, that are b very bullish uh, cardano developer ico hk launches 20 million fund for ecosystem startups that's but um that's very big news again that just shows how bullish they are about the uh, the project which is again it's just big big news cardano developer house iohk has set up a 20 million c fund alongside los angeles based wave financial which is again it's this is just big news all round across for cardano as a whole purely because that is a big amount of money to uh, be bullish on a company effectively the shelly mainnet launch has happened and everyone is excited about that because they didn't delay it it got delayed a while ago uh, but the market and everything was really bad back then so in my opinion this is the perfect opportunity for them to come up and thrive uh, it's very very good sign in my opinion and as well the the coinbase potential uh, this is just next level in my opinion because normally what happens in my opinion when something gets uh listed on coinbase it has a it goes it shoots up but then obviously it finds uh the the retra it retraces back to a stable price but in my opinion that could be the fuel to the fire that could just keep it going and going and going um now i don't think that um it's going to blow up tomorrow and it's going to go to its all-time high tomorrow but if it generally can stick to what it wants to do and it does it very very well i think if cryptocurrency as a whole does what it's supposed to do by next year then i think you could easily see cardano close if not halfway there to its all-time high um and that's just big big news in my opinion it's it's just a whole big new aspect a whole new technology and it's moving moving up in the world as well um with how high it's going up in the leaderboard systems it's just a big big day all round for cardano i also want to quickly show you cardano's roadmap so so far they have just uh announced shelly so now this is the next phase here and then that and then that and if we get to this stage then cardano could be well over two to three dollars but i don't know when that could happen that could be 2025 that could be 2028 I'm not sure it depends how quickly uh, everyone believes in it and it depends how quickly uh, governments as well as big corporations it depends how quickly they look at it and how quickly they think okay this could actually be onto something here I also recommend this is on Cardano's uh, website or they're just type in their roadmap uh, they have a quite a long video here uh, and it explains uh, the whiteboard with Charles Hopkinson uh, now I would recommend if you want to learn a bit more about Cardano to check it out because it is very, very interesting. It does get a bit uh, complicated for those of you that won't possibly understand it, but that's the whole point of learning in my opinion. You've got to attack these things that are complicated. You've got to look into these things that nobody else looks into to be able to understand them, to be able to counteract on these situations. Because if you can counteract on these situations like a lot of us are doing now, we, a lot of us are investing in cryptocurrency, which majority of the world are laughing at us for. They think we're stupid. They think we're crazy. A lot of people will and are starting to to open their eyes, especially, especially the biggest banks, especially the biggest companies. They're all looking at it now. And as soon as they take hold of it and as soon as they effectively adopt it, that's when your next door neighbor will stop laughing at you if he ever was that's when this person will stop laughing at you if they ever were and they will simply ask you how did you know or they'll say oh you got lucky but it's never going to be that case because we have been uh, as a collective community we have been learning about uh, certain projects and certain uh, cryptocurrencies for a while now and these are the cryptocurrencies that i personally believe as well as uh, a lot of other people believe these are the ones that are legitimate and they can change the future and the technology and the economy considering the current state it is in during this current pandemic but we will simply have to see what happens i know i'm very bullish on cryptocurrency as a whole and i want to know how you guys 
what you guys think of cryptocurrency as a whole. I know I've never been bullish on it, more bullish on it in my life. And I've been investing in it for three to four years. And now I genuinely think this is the repercussions of uh, the hard work and the patience that myself and a lot of you guys would have showed as well. Just a little bit longer. My thoughts are just hang on till twenty twenty, uh, the end of 2021. That's my opinion. You will, If you don't start to see a big correlation basically by the end of 2020, then I don't know anymore. But I've never been so sure on something in my life considering the current state of everything. Um, if you guys, that's everything I've got for you guys. If you guys liked anything I bring to you, um, a like, a subscribe, or sharing the video really does help my channel out. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen.